Hey folks, uh, Jim from Slick Audio here. Um, wanted to show you, uh, do a little quick demo of our 4100 series machines. Uh, this is the uh, the i9 10 core box, uh, which is pretty much our base model uh, in the 4100 series. So um, I'm going to stop here and flip over so you can see what we're uh, working on. Uh, running 16 samples at 44.1, 32-bit depth. Uh, yes, you are seeing 0.54 milliseconds in and 0.73 out. This, by the way, is the Quantum 2. Incredible, incredible uh, device um, from Personas. And we are running Studio One 3, uh, latest version here. So uh, anyways, this is a 424 track, 520 active plug-in. Yes, 520 and 24 active virtual instruments running right now and uh do you see my resource meter Ooh, 28 percent 29 percent not bad at 16 samples um just so you can see something here quick i'm gonna run this down to uh up to 32 samples uh because i got a couple of the demos coming for you you can see we're still at 0.91 in and 1.09 out and now i'm gonna drop down to 64 which is pretty standard and what most people do with uh, Studio One. So still very, very, very respectable times. 1.63 in, 1.81 out. So now that you've seen that, I'm going to go ahead and just click OK and get rid of that. Um, and you can see we're running some just phenomenal times here. So uh, without any further ado, I'm going to move on and show you. Um, oh, by the way, just to prove the my number of tracks. Uh, let me scroll down here because these are grouped. But uh, yeah, there's number 424. So just to prove that. Um, anyway, so let me uh, stop this. I'll be right back, and I'm going to show you one better. Uh, now we're back with, um, get this, 848 tracks, 1,040 active plugins, and 48 active VIs. Uh, there's the track. So you can see I'm not uh, BSing. It is actually playing. And uh, we're still at 64 samples, mind you. Not bad, 64%, 66%, 65% with some disc movement. At 64 samples, folks, with that many tracks boining, not bad. All right, there's more coming at you. Hold on. And now, this is going to be a wild one for you, so get ready. 1,272 active tracks, 1,560 active plugins, and 72 active virtual instruments. I do have to run this at 128 samples. Um, obviously, we're really pushing uh, some things here, but uh, look at 3.08 mil in, 3.27 out. So six, uh, six and a third uh, millisecond. It's still in audible, folks, and not bad time, huh? I'd say it's pretty respectable when you're looking at, you know, 72% utilization. Um, out of a machine that's running this many tracks, this many samples, um, or uh, sorry, this many uh, VIs and uh, plugins at, at you know at a fairly insane simple sample rate. So I'm going to push it one more uh, just so you could see um, what 256 does. Um, I'm going to bump that up now because the next one um, we had we have to move to 256 in order to show you because uh, it's just a, a, a well, just a little large. Um, so there you go. So 599 in, 6.17 out. So you're just starting to get to the point of, you know, feeling that for sure. 10 mils uh, and above, you can hear that. But uh, when you're just playing back, um, you're not going to hear that. So uh, the fact of the matter is, is we can do it. And by the way, there's a lot more to go, uh, you know, if we needed to push to 512 or 1024. Um, so when you're doing mix downs, it, it is completely irrelevant. So anyways, you can see things dropped way down here. Uh, but uh, I got another surprise for you. We're going higher yet. Hold on. This time, get this. 1,696 tracks. 2,080 active plugins and 96 active virtual instruments, not frozen running on this machine simultaneously right now so it's um quite astounding actually what uh what is doable here with this box um it, it it's just absolutely amazing uh performance by the way you know we are hitting some uh some disc sp spikes 
uh, a little bit. Um, but I mean, you know, quite honestly, um, as, as my friends would say, this is probably insanity. Um, and uh, if you're doing that many and you're not freezing your VIs, I'd say there's something wrong with you, seriously. But uh, anyway, so I uh, just wanted to prove that. And I got a couple more up my sleeve here, so I'll be right back again. Somebody did a video post the other day um, and uh, about Mai Tai and uh, how many instances uh, they could run um, or were running on this particular one machine that they had. And I don't even know what it was. But anyways, um, here's 40 because that was their maximum. And I'm using uh, mostly Mai Tai, but I've got a couple of uh, instances of presence uh, in there as well. Um, but most of it, as you can see, is Mai Tai. Mai Tai, Mai Tai, Mai Tai, Mai Tai, Mai Tai. You know, that was a short little track that I just threw together a couple of seconds. So, but bottom line is, um, we are running at 64 samples. <laughs> this over here it's a little cleaner for you to see yeah that would be uh you know 30 to 37 to 40 percent 30 percent um zero percent disc and mind you these are not frozen these are just straight up and we are running at 64 samples so i figured well why not since it's in the spirit of things let's uh take it one better eh all right hold on here is 80 instruments <laughs> basically doubled the size of the uh, the last project so uh, and you can see them there they are da, 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 da. kind of going backwards here but you get the general idea these are real they are functional and they are playing right now as we speak there you go so this would be 80 Stop and restart this baby again. Because it's a shorty. So, 80 tracks of that. And uh, I'm going to scoot over here and show you this. Performance meter, guys. I'm still at 64 samples, by the way. So, I'm running uh, under 70 um, percent CPU utilization. Um, whilst running 80 active Mai Tais and the like, not 40, 80, at 64 samples. So if we wanted to cut this back and um, do something a little uh, different, um, I could easily go into here. See, we are still running 64 samples. All right, so just for grins, I'll just bump this thing to 128. And uh, now we've dropped to, and we're always going to get the, the burst, because VIs are still VIs. So the samples are how quickly we get audio through, guys. And VIs consume CPU like uh, mad, because that's their job. They're actually doing real instrumentation and real work. So how about if I take it one further for you? Last one. Hold on. I'm now running 100 uh, I can find my mouse. Wow, cool, huh? Still the same. Yeah, we peaked at uh, 78, whatever the hell that was. Like, it popped up quick. Bottom line is we're on 70%. And uh, just to prove the point here, I'm scrolling down there. 100 active virtual instruments functioning at once. So musicians um, who play live... I think our machines are well capable of doing it, uh, doing the job for you. And um, those uh, of you who, uh, who are doing recording in your basement or recording for professional purposes, um, y'all need a uh, 4100 series. These things rip. Um, let me stop and turn the camera around so I can finish things up. All right, so instead of pointing at the machine, you can look at my ugly face for the last couple of minutes. Any, in any event, um, 4100 series is an absolutely amazing machine, and uh, they are available on our store right now, and we've been selling them. 
uh, like crazy. So uh, people are seeing these things and, and watching the performance just out of, out of control. Uh, Personas, uh, again, thank you. Uh, Studio One um, 3 Pro and, um, and a Quantum 2 interface running Thunderbolt into our one of our T4100 machines. By the way, this is 64 gig of RAM. This is the 10 core i9 X processor and um, it just rips. All right, guys. Cheers. Be good. Talk to you.